Another song as requested I, by Kevin Franklin. I've been asking for finally some decent music on this show. Ring of Fire, which is oh. appropriate because we're talking about jerk chicken and it's spicy. So Father's Day will be here before Hold on. you know it. Hold on. A fiery ring. <laughs> Thanks, Johnny. Cash. We're about to cash in on Father's Day, courtesy celebrity chef Chuck Hughes. So yeah. you're talking about sides today. Talking about sides, um, so I launched a line of products about two years ago, uh, and so I've got two new products here, and uh, for Father's Day, um, I was going to... The kids? Yeah, the kids, you know, yeah. The kids, but yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm going to give you all of my products today. Well, you, you just know? ruined their surprise. <laughs> Thank you, Chuck. Yeah. So they, you don't have to go out and buy it, but you still can. Right? And we can buy it anyway, right, you said, right? Um, so are you going to help me out a bit? Do what we can. Parker. Do what you can. <laughs> so, first of all, I, I'm kind of keeping it simple, and like you said, it, it's sides. So, we've got uh, a bruschetta, something really easy, something kind of uh, you can kind of put together with a lot of stuff that you probably have in your house. First thing I did, I think you could probably cut bread. I'm hoping. I'm right. hoping. He's, he's becoming quite the, uh, the griddle chef. Yeah. Okay, so By the way. first and foremost, <laughs> you want to cut the bread. So far, you guys follow. Yeah. Okay, a little bit of olive oil, and what I like to do is. M mush it, squish it. Mush it, squish it. Soak it, it in. Yes. Soak it in. Soak it in, okay? Yeah. So soak once in, that's soaked in, in, boom, right on there. And then you got something that looks kind of like this. Okay. Okay, very simple. You want it warm and a little bit charred? Okay. Warm, a little bit charred, uh, a lot of olive oil. Mm -hmm. And you want it nice and crispy. Yes. So pretty much good to go. We have some, I'm going to turn this off. Okay, and then we have some roasted red peppers. Uh, could I use asparagus? Yes. Could I use... Broccoli? Yes. yes. Could I use in whatever's in season, whatever you have, whatever you want to use. And then I've got some feta. Mm. Okay. And once again, this is just because I like the saltiness of it. Um, the but you could, yeah, you could use really yeah. anything you want. So I kind of just crumble it right on top. If you want, you want to go a little bit further, you can actually fry it. Ooh. Mm -hmm. You know, you dust it in a little bit of flour, you fry it up, it's nice and crispy. Oh, yeah. Uh, and then we add just a touch, and I'm going to use some of that oil because it's spicy and delicious, the okay. oil that's in these eggplants. But really, it's kind of just something that you can assemble with stuff that you probably have in your house. You can in do your pantry. Yeah. You could do that. You know what I mean? I think you could probably try. You could do that. Yeah. Okay, and then a little bit of oregano. Fresh oregano. Okay, fresh Get oregano. Get the fresh stuff. I can't tell you how what Salt a difference pepper. it makes. Okay. You can grow it, right? How yeah. do you grow it? Um, and I know you do a lot of cooking at home, right? Yes. Um, so, pretty easy, pretty simple. I'm not going to add any olive oil. I'm going to let it go because there's quite a bit of olive oil in there already. How do you eat uh, it, Chef? Like, do you shove the thing in your mouth? Do you cut it? I think you use a fork okay, and a knife. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. And by, <laughs> We're classy. And by, okay. the way, by the way, two of my kids are good cooks. Oh, oh dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. We, we know it's not <laughs> That's all I'm sorry. Uh, and so I'm going to move over here. Hey, Kellen's like, I'm one of the good ones. Just, <laughs> I let them all know. Um, so, jerk marinade. Yes. Spicy. Uh, people know it for jerk chicken, uh, maybe mm -hmm. jerk pork, uh, jerk fish. Uh, and I do have some ribs and shrimp over there. But what I'm doing today is kind of a, um, a jerk potato salad. Yeah. So not everybody eats meat. Uh, you want you know, the flavor. And, and when yeah. you think of jerk, you always think, oh, chicken, chicken. So I want and, to do something yeah. a little bit different. I've never um, heard of jerk uh, potato salad. You? I've heard of a jerk TV host. <laughs> oh. Me. Okay. Yeah. And so. Uh, I didn't let people joke. think I was talking about With you. The joke. Onion, garlic. Mm. Shave it right in there. See, How are those it. potatoes done? Are they, are they right soft? Or you know are what? They just a little parboiled. Just a little soft, parboiled, and really simple. Green onion. Was that ginger chives, mustard? Parsley. Yeah, a little bit, and then the jerk. Okay. Mm. Oh, what a great and, idea! And you kind of go heavy on it, honestly. Yeah, uh, more is more. You have something that looks like this in the end. If you want to add mayo, you can. If you want to leave it out, you can. It's really wow. kind of all about what you want. But I'm telling you, mm, you talk uh, some chives, make it all pretty. Yeah. Neat for summer. And like, I, I, I tend to like, you know, you want to switch it up. You want to add other things in there. You could. I okay. Mean, Where's really Kelly? Kelly flew from Vancouver. Her arms are so tired, and she said she is starving. You ready, Sweet Pea? Uh -oh. There you go. Uh -oh. Right in here, growing. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. You're having this for, for breakfast? More information, everybody. We didn't even try television. it. <laughs> and then, the, then we just put saran wrap over it, and then they can give it to me on Sunday. It, it, it'll last. Yeah. Keep it in the fridge. Uh, right now, we're going to throw things up over to Mel. Enjoy the pool. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs>